WA Javelin thrower Kim Mickle is in Korea best form, posting a personal best in Germany just a month out from the London Olympics. But as Katie Price has discovered, Mickle is not your normal glamour female Aussie athlete. She's a lover of beer, footy and heavy metal music. For some, living next door to an Olympian would be a proud achievement. For others, too much to bear. one house next door that actually bowled their house down because they had enough of us, so... <laughs> but Kim Mickle is hoping to come home from London with a heavy metal of a different kind as Australia's best female javelin thrower. I'm definitely going to uh, turn a few heads, I think, when I head over there in the next couple of weeks and, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm ready to go and, yeah, I'm definitely... I think I'm going to freak out a few people, that's for sure. Mickle has been flying under the radar, sitting out competition in favour of a heavy training program. She's been on the men since last year's World Champs when she did her back in the qualifying rounds, broke a rib in the final, but still managed a qualifying throw. I didn't think I could hurt myself anymore, so I just let it rip and uh, it happened. So I think I actually broke the rib on my fourth throw yet through my biggest throws on the fifth and sixth. Javelin throwers need to be all-round athletes and there's nothing this girl can't do. She bench presses 105 kilos, can kick a footy and gives that right arm a workout on the basketball court. Oh, yes. It's legit, yeah, yeah. A lot of people go, you can't throw full court. I'm like, yes, I can. My problem is, is I throw it over the ring, so I can't sit still. Like, in here, I'm like, Ugh. Making music the perfect tonic. Anything that has a fair bit of double kick in it gets me going, but I love all different sorts of music. Like my folks, they um, they used to listen to Akadaka and, and Led Zepp and all that sort of stuff. So I sort of grew up being a bogan, but I've just uh, I've just kept it going. <laughs> Katie Price, 10 News.